What's up, everybody? So we're gonna be going up to Onyx Summit right now for you all, and then on the way back, we're gonna stop through the upper portions of Sugarloaf for you all. But I've been getting the request for Onyx Summit, so we are going to, going to do that for you. And also, on the way to Onyx, there was one little stop that I was asked of, and uh, since it's on the way, I think we'll just drive through there real quickly, okay? All right. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button for those of you who've been watching for a long time and feel like I have earned it. I would really appreciate it. It helps a lot. And go to BigBearWeatherAndMore.com if you want your merchandise. And until the end of the storm on Friday, if you go there and when you check out, type in the discount code STORM, S-T-O-R-M. You will save some money on your order. And it will help, help me out big time, guys. Help out help out our channel so you know what we're, we're not gonna do this first stop we're gonna do that on the way back we're gonna get onyx taken care of and then also for your ski and snowboard rental needs go to get boards on Big Bear Boulevard they have two stores one for skis one for snowboards and they are both one block from the village and the other one is two blocks away from the village both of them on Big Bear Boulevard if you mention me and bring your own skis and snowboard in they will wax them for free but you must mention this channel and to save some money on lift tickets go to getboards.com if you order them 72 hours in advance you'll save a, a, a bunch of money compared to if you go to the ticket window the day of skiing at the resort so you'll save a bunch of money 72 hours in advance at getboards.com check them out you guys will be stoked I've had a lot of responses already about how happy you've been there so I knew that was a great place and it makes me happy that everyone's loving it so far the comments are a, a, a lot about the customer service which is so important all right guys we're on our way to Onyx we're on highway 38 right now to see how much snow's up there. We're starting off at 30 degrees. I don't know if you can really see it. 30 degrees. And I'm gonna guess it's gonna be about 24 degrees up there. What's your guess, babe? Um, 25. 25 degrees, okay, there we go. She's just gotta be different. <laughs> Guys, since we're driving straight right now, keep your eye on those clouds. Look how fast they're rolling in over there. It's just so pretty. And there's there's the front of it right there. That is so cool. Look, it's all blue sky over here for the most part. It's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. It's so Just by your house, bro. I'm making a video. Can I hit you up in about an hour or so? Okay, guys. This is the chain checkpoint. This is where I feel so good because we have all-wheel drive and snow tires. <laughs> Sorry, guys. That was. Yep. There's. There goes some sub subscribe. Some subscribers right there. <laughs> They're gone. Chain control enforced. Violators will be cited. You're like, yeah, well, if you can catch me. Oh, this guy is being forced to turn around. Why? Oh, I thought that was a Subaru. That's horrible. So all these cars are being t turned around. Does this guy have snow tires, though? Oh, I feel so bad, guys. I feel so bad. I don't like seeing that. But again, guys, it's it, it's no joke. It's for your safety. It's it's a life or death. It really is a life or death situation. So. What do you think right now with the way this road looks? Do people need chains on their tires? Well, babe, you gotta keep in mind we're going much higher up in elevation, and the roads are probably gonna look like this, maybe even worse. So right right now, no. But well, actually, I mean, I think. I think yeah, I think yeah, I think they would be behooved to wear to wear tire chains, to 
to apply the uh, tire chains for sure. But it's just gonna get worse and worse the higher up we go. It's already 29 degrees now. We're already dropping in temperature. But yeah, guys, it's all for your safety. Thankfully, this side of the mountain gets a lot of sunlight when we have storms going on. on the Passing way too fast. Sorry, baby. <laughs> <laughs> so, guys, that's 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 the kind of person you're gonna see in a ditch, which no one wants to see that. But don't drive like that up here because, as I said, now, now it's 28 degrees. It's already dropping quickly as we climb. So, even though there's a few areas where you don't see any white on the road, it's probably black ice. So just. Be very careful, guys. Oh. I had to give them the old train horn. Hang guys, on, guys. For your safety, I just pulled in. I backed into this really deep snow area so you don't have to listen to the train horn. And here we go. This is the furthest neighborhood from anything, any type of civilization in Big Bear. It's called um, Lake Williams. There's a few houses up here higher elevation. They still get a decent amount of snow over here, but not as much as by the Big Bear Dam. Temperature's 28 degrees. 28. And it's fall, 28 and falling. Because we are cluck, cluck, cluck climbing. Also, baby, as I said, because of the uh, cold temperatures, even if there's not much of the white stuff on the road here, a lot of this is is wet and it's it's gonna be icy. Can we kiss? Not while I'm driving. Absolutely not. Good. There you go. All right, baby. Yeah, I love you, babe. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Looking down the mountain, I hope we can see it. I'm I tell we could walk down there. I know, I know, babe. Okay, this view right here, I'm gonna have to stick the camera out the window, guys. Hopefully you can see it. icy right here guys this is exactly why they're making you put on chains oh babe that is so beautiful so we got a car coming up behind us and we're gonna let him pass at the next little area where we can pull over that's what you need to do up here to keep traffic flowing guys we're not in a hurry because we're trying to record the beauty All the, yeah, it's really icy, guys. I'm slipping and sliding a bit. Woo! You feel that, babe? Oh, yeah. What's the temp, babe? 28 still. Oh, 28. It, it felt like it got a little bit colder. Didn't it? Oh, my gosh. That view. There, there's the real desert down there. Holy moly. Yeah, totally. You can see it crystal clear. 
Coming back down, guys, this view is going to be oh, epic. Wow. Isn't that amazing, thing? That so it's so clear down there. Look at all that land. It's just empty land. Just completely. It's hard to imagine that the entire Earth all looked like that at one point. 27 degrees. Yeah, right, babe? Totally, right? Well, we are, we are. Thank you for suggesting going up to Onyx Summit. And after this car passes, I'm gonna let this guy pass here. Holy smokes. I've never seen it so clear down there, or it's been years. It's absolutely gorgeous. I can't believe this, babe. I cannot believe this. This is what I feel heaven would look like. We're at 8,000 feet elevation. We got no 26 degrees, 26 degrees. So my wife said 25, I said 24 at the top. Let's see. And yeah, now we're starting to get into the bigger snow the higher up we are. Look at all this, babe. If I'm on my way to the airport to go to Hawaii or something, you know? It's just such a good feeling. Yeah, I can definitely see why chains are required, guys. It is so slick. guys 25 come on one more degree give me one more degree before we go to the top and now it's just yeah nice and packed down I'd rather drive on this than this dark pavement that doesn't have any ice or snow on it. Because it's just ice. Well, I mean, it does have ice on it, but it's just icy. Summit, there's a, a few places if the kids just get so just uh, restless and want to go sledding and play, play in the snow. This this big parking lot area right here, we're at the top. Oh, it, 
Oh, look what a great snowman that is. <laughs> is that a snowman or is it a tree with snow on it? It's a snowman. Maybe. Uh -huh. Oh no. Well, maybe. It looks like it has buttons and eyes. Wow, guys. No, because I don't have time. I have to work, sadly. I wish we had time to do that. I got people just waiting for me. I would love to build a snowman. We could try to build one in front of the house on the life loop. Okay. I'd rather you just make one snowman. Make one. I love you too, brother. Well, then I'll make the real one with you. Hey, I'll be back in about two hours. Hang on, guys. Just responding to some people, but with this beautiful view. Hope you guys are okay. Just chilling for a second. Thank you so much, my dude. I appreciate that. Right, guys, I mean, seriously, this is just something else. So, baby, on most of this drive going down the hillside, we're at 8,443 feet, by the way, guys. And it stayed at 25 degrees. My wife won. My wife won. So, look at how much snow they have up here. It's beautiful. But I was saying we're we'll probably gonna have to keep that down for most of this so I can get some of the best views. You tell me as soon as you get cold, okay, honey? Here it comes. <laughs> Going down, we're gonna have to be extra cautious. We got someone behind us, so we're gonna let them pass and let them go speeding down. guys I'll do this all day because again it's what you're supposed to do keeps traffic flowing the work going down this I'll I will not touch the brake once going down this probably seeing some beautiful views on the right hand side oh my gosh man. oh my gosh I'm so sorry honey Uh, did it go back to 26? No, it's 25 still.
you happy with this, babe? Yeah, it's nice. Beautiful, right? So, my friend Jonathan lives over by that place, so I can just drop you off on the way to, to Jonathan's, okay? zoom in on this part, I promise you, you will not regret it. You will be so happy. I'm going to stick the camera out, out the window just for a second, okay guys? Backside. We'll have to check, babe, because you might not be able to get down. Because last night they had change required on the, on the backside. I didn't think about that. Wow. head is that John John Denver song country roads I know the camera keeps going all over the place, guys, but this is, this is a sight. This is an absolute sight of some spectacular beauty. You know what, we'll catch Sugarloaf on the next drive. I just want this to be a straight Onyx Summit video. Back up to 27 degrees, y'all. And you can see those are the clouds that we were pretty deep into at the beginning of the earlier drive today, about an hour ago. The Big Bear Snow Rule Drive. And it was snowing.
the summertime, none of you are going to remember exactly where we're at, but we're close to Lake Williams. Right behind this tree, right over here, where this yellow ice sign is, you'll have cops hiding right there to come and get you for speeding down this mountain road. Again, guys, don't forget, you don't want to do any real speeding up here or, or anything like that because our town makes a lot of money, which is understandable for people breaking the law, like speeding and not parking where they're supposed to. So I just don't want any of you to get any tickets while you're up here. Right, once we get to the chain checkpoint, that's when we're going to stop this Onyx Summit video. Obviously, the chain checkpoint's only to go out because if we're right here, it means we've already been approved on the other side of the mountain to come up. So. Again, I can see why they, they enforced it, so please bring your tire chains with you. snow straight straight in front of us off the tree very cool all right if we can get out of the low gears we're good Thank you guys again for cruising. I hope you enjoyed. That was probably, that had to be the most beautiful drive we've done all storm. Because of being able to see all the way down to the desert, crystal clear, blue skies. Just absolutely wonderful. But yeah, once again, guys, thank you for being here with us. If you like what I do, hit the like and, like and subscribe button. I would appreciate it. And here's the chain checkpoint. Highway 38. Oh, those folks are still stopped over there. That's such a bummer. All right, baby. Say say bye bye. Bye guys. Take care, guys. Once again, BigBearWeatherMore.com. If you use the word "storm" in the checkout area, you'll save 10 or 15 percent. I can't remember. I think it's 10 percent on your whole order. And uh, yeah, thanks again for everything. Thanks for cruising with us, and uh, have a very blessed rest of your day. We'll see you later. Take care, guys. Bye now.